There have been many defining moments in the history of the Met Office, but one of the most memorable ones was the great storm of 1987. Wind gusts exceeding 100 miles an hour led to trees blowing down, power being cut off and sadly 18 people being killed. Following this storm, the National Severe Weather Warning Service was established to provide warnings to the general public to protect life and property from the effects of severe weather. The purpose of the National Severe Weather Warning Service is to warn the public and emergency responders of severe or hazardous weather which has the potential to cause danger to life or widespread disruption. Warnings are issued for rain, snow, wind, fog and ice. They are given a colour depending on the combination of both the likelihood of the event happening and the impact the conditions may have. Warnings are issued out to five days ahead for the UK and occur in two forms, alerts and warnings. Alerts are issued when the expected conditions are more than 24 hours ahead. Warnings are issued if severe weather is expected in the next 24 hours. Warnings are given a colour depending on a combination of both the likelihood of the event and the impact of the conditions. These vary from yellow through amber and into red. Each warning is issued with a chief forecaster's assessment, which explains why the warning has been given the colour it has, as well as indicating where any uncertainties lie and any additional information. All warnings can be found on the Met Office website, which also gives advice on what to do before, during and after severe weather. You can also see our warnings on our mobile apps and can sign up to our Twitter feed for all the latest warnings. Mm -hmm.